Hey there, Kids Church. It's Miss Amy, and I'm so happy to see you today as we learn about how God's got the whole world in his hands. So come along with me as we start our Kids Church Day. It's time now for our opening prayer, the Johnny Appleseed song. So have your big singing voices and follow me as we sing this prayer together. Oh, the Lord's been good to me, and so I thank the Lord for giving me the things I need, like the sun and the rain and the apple seed. The Lord's been good to me. Amen, 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 amen. Today we are celebrating that God has the whole world in his hands. And we know that because the Bible tells us so, especially from the book of Job, chapter 12, verse 10. In his hands is the life of every creature. The book of Job is a poetry book from the Old Testament, which means that it was written before Jesus was born. If you want to, pause the video and go look for the book of Job in your Bible. When we say that God's got the whole world in his hands, it means that God loves every single person on the earth and cares about them and wants to protect them and keep them okay. And we are so thankful to worship and serve a God that loves everyone the same way. So remember, today's scripture or today's word from the Bible is in his hand is the life of every creature. That's found from the book of Job, chapter 12, big number 12, verse 10, little number 10. In his hands is the life of every creature. Job 12, 10. Let's continue to remember that God's got the whole world in his hands by learning a new song. You guessed it. The title is, He's Got the Whole World in His Hands. Sing with me as we learn this song together. It goes like this. He's got the whole world in his hands. 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 Let's try the next part. He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. Now let's do this part about creation. He's got the sun and the rain in his hands. He's got the moon and the stars in his hands. He's got the wind and the clouds in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the rivers and the mountains in his hands. He's got the oceans and the seas in his hands. He's got you and he's got me in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got everybody here in his hands. He's got everybody there in his hands. He's got everybody everywhere in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. Amen. Thanks be to God. 
We're going to try this song one more time. And as we sing it, I want you to come up with some hand motions to go along with the song. So maybe the whole world in his hands, you can create a big ball with your hands like a basketball could go through your arms. So the whole world, maybe for you got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. Maybe you could put out one hand and then the other hand for brothers and sisters. And then the sun, reach up your arms high. And then the rain, twinkle them down. And then the moon and the blinky stars. You get the point. So as we sing, think of some body movements that we can do to worship God as we sing together. Again, he's got the whole world in his hands. Here we go. Think about what you can do. He's got the whole world in his hands. 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 He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the sun and the rain in his hands. He's got the moon and the stars in his hands he's got the wind and the clouds in his hands he's got the whole world in his hands he's got the rivers and the mountains in his hands he's got the ocean and the seas in his hands he's got you and he's got me in his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got everybody here. In his hands, he's got everybody there. In his hands, he's got everybody everywhere. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. Great singing voices, everyone. Do you remember today's scripture or word from the Bible? That's right. It's Job chapter 12. In his hand is the life of every creature. Today I want to read us a story called Right Now I Am Fine. Written by Dr. Daniela Owen and illustrated by Goose Balick. Here we go. Sometimes bad things happen in the world and they make us feel scared. Sometimes these things make us worry about what is going to happen next. Our family, friends, and neighbors may all be affected. All of this worry can make us feel terrible. Our tummies may seem like they are tied up in knots. It may feel hard to breathe like an elephant is sitting on our chest. Our heads may be so full of worried thoughts that we can't concentrate on anything else. But when this happens, it is important to remind ourselves that we are fine right now. To help yourself calm down, start by closing your eyes. Then take three deep breaths Breathe in slowly and breathe out slowly. Now keep your eyes closed. Gently wrap your arms around your body 
and give yourself a big, warm hug. You can handle this because right now you are here and you are not in any danger. Let your body relax a little, drop your shoulders and wiggle your toes. You don't have to be on high alert at this moment. Let worrying thoughts drift out of your mind. The bad things may still be happening, but you don't have to worry about them this minute because right now you are fine. What else can you do to relax? Can you draw a pretty picture? Can you look out the window at the beautiful world outside? Can you read a funny, exciting, or adventurous book? Can you play a fun game or solve a tricky puzzle? Can you cuddle a furry pet or a favorite stuffed animal? Then remind yourself, right now, I am fine. The end. And you know what, Kids Church? Right now, we are fine because God's got the what? That's right. God's got the whole world in his hands. And today's scripture always reminds us that in his hand is the life of every creature. Job 12.10 I am so happy that you were able to join with me today as we learned more about how God's got the whole world in his hands. And because of that, right now, I am fine. Let's close today's Kids Church by saying together the prayer that Jesus taught us to say. We can find this prayer in scripture or the Bible, same thing when Jesus is talking to us from the gospel. Let us pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Until next time, Kids Church, go in love.